We bout to play 2K Brutal Sims, step back, J Kobe got that clutch, throw it up, that's game What up, what up It's your boy You don't know Brutal Sim on the scene Wicked on me with the next episode of Brutal Thoughts, man I was watching the live stream The live stream with 2K Yesterday, man I I think LD2K was playing on my team And Ronnie was there And they were playing my team And they were talking and stuff like that Talking about They, they said that um, they appreciate Listening about some of the problems in the game Which is something they mentioned And they also said Something that stuck to me, man That I decided to make this video about They said that right now They're on the road trying to work on 2K18 because you know every year there's a new installment and they're one of the few franchises that make yearly the game on a yearly basis right which is true which is true compared to all the other games that's like sports games gonna be doing it right um do you all think that 2k should extend that year to like two years or three years man listen me out man listen me out i don't think we had nowhere close to a complete game Nothing close to a complete game this time around, y'all. All right? All the problems we got from the beginning. The mock rail wasn't working right. The park wasn't working right. The pro-am wasn't working right. I, I can't speak on my team and all those other game modes, but those these game modes are what I play religiously, right? The, the um, my career, the cutscenes were messed up. You wasn't getting the endorsements right. Um, um, those connections was messed up. A bunch of stuff was messed up, right? The park, you equip certain things you couldn't unequip. The servers are trash. I don't want to elaborate on the servers that much, man, because that don't really got anything to do with the game being complete. It's just them willing to invest in some servers, right? But it had way too much problems in the park as yet. Old Town recently became playable. It was not. Old Town was terrible for the longest while, man, right? In fact, 2K, what, it, it was like a month ago or, so, or a month and a half ago, dropped three patches, patch after patch after patch, trying to fix this game. And the game has already been months out there and, and probably went through like 10 huge patches already. All these patches. This is probably a record setting year for patches. This is how broke the game was or how the game just wasn't nowhere close to being complete and I think it's probably because of this yearly installment schedule that they're forced to, like like they got themselves into so every year you're looking forward to a, a new 2k this year it was so bad we still playing on the same parks from 2k 16 we still playing on these same parks and they're acting like it's something new. No, it isn't. We play on the same parks. There's brightness up a little bit or whatever. Alright. But there's nothing innovative about it. They added a bunch of new um park events and all this nonsense. And it was just they put this on the 2K15 courts. And we had them there. Messing up um rivalry there, of course, again, as I mentioned, but I I think they had us this time around as big, just a beta test the game, man. This guy, it just does not know. It, it didn't feel no way close to a um, complete game. So we were be basically beta testing. And we still are. Now, hopefully, we get a complete thing um, game with the release of 2K18. But I highly doubt it, man. Just because of the fact of this one year cycle. This annual cycle that they are on, and it's all about the benches. But what I'm saying, man, is this. They could have done this, man. They could have put it for a three-year span, right? And probably, if, if they're thinking about the money for the games every year, they could just keep dropping additional content in that three years. In fact, they don't even got to do that because the average person that plays 2K already spends double um, or triple for the games with all these VC sales and all that shit, man. All right, but this game, I ain't gonna front y'all, man. This, I like the game. Don't get me wrong, man. I enjoy the game when it's working, but too many times it's not. And this might be one of the worst 2K experience 
in terms of the game giving so much trouble to get in, to loading screens, to to being lagged out, to it, it, it just record breaking, man. All right. So let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. Do you think 2K could afford to extend um the time period for developing the game from one year? two three let's say about three years two to three years right which will give them a lot more time to beta test the right way probably test out the servers um just make sure just to make sure you pull out a complete product instead of this thing that they gave us which was nowhere close to being complete man all right i'm not trying to knock on 2k i know the schedule is probably tight man but i gotta call a spade a spade man y'all know how it is bro all right Y'all know how it is, man. They, I, I can't do it no other way, man. So let me know in the comments what y'all think. It's your boy Sim. If you're first time to my channel, like the video, share the video, hit your boy, subscribe. If not your first time, like the video, share the video. You never know who's gonna help or who's gonna have something to say about this, man. You don't know your boy Sim. One of respect. Bless.